Here we're told Hana makes beaded bracelets for sale. The materials for each bracelet cost $2 and she sells the bracelets for $7.25 each. To find her profit, she writes this equation. They want us to explain what X represents. So let's take a closer look at the equation. So what is this equation calculating? It says to find her profits, she writes this equation. So this equation must calculate her profits. That must be what P represents, profit. So we know the answer is not A, profit represents P, not X. Now let's think about how you calculate the profit. If you have a business, you're gonna earn money from your business, but you also have to pay for the materials that you are making or the materials you are selling. So to calculate profit, you need to have your sales, the money you get from your sales, and subtract the money you get, or the money you have to pay to, um, to make whatever you're selling. So that's your cost. So this first portion of our equation, 725 times X, that represents the money from our sales. So this represents the money from our sales, not X. Now, this here represents the cost. So $2 times X represents the cost of our materials. So not just X, but $2 times X represents the cost. So I think the answer is C, but let's just see if that makes sense. Does X represent the number of bracelets sold? So let's read this. Profit equals 725, which is the cost that you're, or the price you're selling the bracelets for, 725 times the number of bracelets sold, minus $2, which is the cost for the materials to make your bra bracelet, times the number of bracelets sold. That makes sense. So for this one, the answer is C.